May, of course. So uh, what I'm doing is I'm doing the Makeup Mayhem uh, videos. And so I'm going to have the list in the description below of all the videos I'm going to be making for the month of May. But today's is my April favorites, which is kind of weird since the month of May. But now that April is over, I can make this video. So um, let's get right into it. My first favorite is a brush, and this is the brush that came with the Sephora Divergent set. And it's uh, double-ended, it's got this really nice um, fluffy shader part on it, and then it's got a um, <clears throat> a blush brush up here, and this is super soft, and it's like the duo, like fibers and stuff, it's really great. I apply all my blushes with this, and I just, first what I do is I get the blush powder, and then I pout it pat it on my hand and it kind of like disperses it in the brush all over and then I pat it on, I brush it on. I love this brush, it's so great and then this part is where I use the inner corners and the outer corner and um, it just helps really d diffuse the colors and blend them out. So this is great, this is an awesome brush. Uh, I'm sure you can find all kinds of Sephora brushes at Sephora of course. Um, my favorite lipstick this month, uh, I actually have two, but this one is the Just Peachy from Wet n Wild, and I might have talked about this in my last video, but it's this like really nice peach color, and it's like a very light pale coral, and it's what I'm wearing today. Mm. It's just a, like a muted nude, and like I can wear this with pretty much anything with heavy eyes or with light eyes, and it really just lets lets things be as they are. Like, but it still like brings color back to my lips because sometimes when I put my foundation on, it like covers my lips up and takes away all the color out of them. The second lip color that is my favorite this month is this Stay Super Stay 24 Hour by Maybelline. By Maybelline, and it's this one is in fire red. I'm trying to find the color. Oh, I think it's oh, keep up the flame, and keep up the flame, and it's like this super pigmented red red color, like the color of my hair. <laughs> oh yeah, you guys, I got my hair colored since last time I made a video. Um, it's a little messy right now, so that's why I have a lot in the back and then in front. But I'm loving it myself. Let me know, guys, what you think in the comments. But this is like a super pigmented red. And this is a cool system. I have to do a video about this. Uh, I had it on, and it stayed on for eight hours consistently. And I even ate a meal and had some drinks, and it stayed on through that. So this is pretty amazing. It um, You put on this, and then you let it, like... Uh, get dry on your lips and then you put on it's got like this special balm that goes with it and you put that over top and it just stays fresh throughout the whole day I think you have to like keep refreshing the balm though or else it like starts to crack but it's really nice I like I said eight hours and I ate so that's pretty amazing <laughs> another eye product that I'm really loving this month is this from Rimmel London the extreme pop lash and this is a purple mascara if you can see here and I'm not wearing this today but I am definitely a fan I love uh, purple with my hazel green eyes and so it really helps them pop and the colors to just show through uh, I think I got this for like three dollars at five below they also have green and blue and I think orange. I think I'm going to go back and get the blue, but I'm not sure. But yeah, it's my favorite, obviously. Um, something that I had always heard of from 11th Gorgeous, who I watch on here consistently, um, is the Jordana Fabu Liner, uh, the liquid eyeliner pen. And I already use the e.l.f. eyeliner pen, but this is, it's very similar um, but this I felt like went on a lot smoother. I don't know if it's the formula or like the tip that's on this. It only costs like two dollars at most, like with tax or whatever. But it's really great. It went on really nicely today. You can see I winged out my liner a bit, 
and it really just went on perfectly. It doesn't tug on your eye or anything. So this is definitely a new favorite. I definitely like it and it's very precise. It helps you get perfect lines. Uh, something I got in an Ipsy bag that I've been loving is this City Color White Gold. Now you can get City Color products at um, uh, at Five Below. I got a big bronzer from them at Five Below and this would be, I think it's retail of like $4 for this, but it's a highlight eyeshadow cream kind of and it's, I gotta get it open. <laughs> oh. That's lame. I don't know if it's because it's hot today or something. But I can't get it open, but it's like this really creamy shadow, and it's white, but it really reflects gold in light, and I love it. It's like, it's actually like when you turn it in the light, I wish I could get this open. There we go. Let me show you. Okay, that was a decent amount. You can see that it's like white here, but when you turn in the light, it actually turns basically gold and so awesome. It's a fantastic um, cream highlight shadow. I use it in my inner corners and up here on my highlight, and it looks great. Um, and then the last two things I have are eyeshadow palettes. Uh, my first one is from BH Cosmetics, and it's their Galaxy palette. Now, I know this is an old palette. This is from last year. Um, but I saw it in somebody's videos, I think in X Sparkage, and then I saw these colors and just... I've been rebuilding my makeup collection, kind of, with, like, I'm, I'm s slowly moving out of the elf phase of my life and moving into more, uh... Uh, higher end stuff just as I've been coming into money and stuff just trying to to build up a, a better makeup collection and so this is a really great pigmented baked eyeshadow palette you can use these wet or dry and they will have just beautiful effects either way um, my favorite colors from this are Jupiter I'm just gonna swatch these really quick Aphrodite and um and comet oh my gosh comet and meteor oh, i will show you meteor as well but aren't these just the most beautiful colors you have ever seen in a palette and like that's just like i barely like just rub my finger over the top of those colors and this is the kind of payoff it gives. And it, like, uh, my one complaint is that, like, if I put it down here on my lid first, and then I go back in and I start blending up here, it starts to fall out a little off the lid. So my recommendation is to do any, like, uh, crease colors first, like your darker crease colors first, and then go back and put the light, light colors on your lid second. Um, just wiping off the makeup. Um... And then my last thing is from the Sephora Divergent Collaboration Collection. I am a huge Divergent fan. I am currently reading, I was going to grab Allegiant, but I forgot it's like sitting under my computer to help prop up the height. But um, this is one of the palettes from the Divergent uh, Makeup Collection where they collaborated with Sephora. And this one is the Abnegation palette. And it comes with these four colors and then a transformation shade. The cool thing about these transformation shades, there's three of these long palettes in the collection. And these ones break off. <laughs> it's so cool. You can actually switch out from the three different eyeshadow palettes. You can switch out the, uh, the different transformer shades. Uh, I don't like to use them as much unless it's like a special event because they're super like glittery. Um, but... These are the four colors it comes with. This one is Bold Espresso, Intrepid Moss, uh, Golden Honesty, and Altruistic Almond. And I know where Honesty comes from. That's from Candor. But I don't know where these other color names come from. But this is what I use today to create this look. I have Bold Espresso up in my crease. And then across the lid, I have Intrepid Moss. And on the center, 
of my lid, I have the Golden Honesty. And then this is what I used. The Ultra Stick Almond is what I used as a highlight color. Um, I love these palettes so much. You can grab and go just one, or if maybe you're going to an event with some friends and you would do all kinds of makeup, you can take all three. Um, they form the Ferris wheel from Divergent. And then uh, the palette, the whole collection case came with a blush bronzer highlighter as well. So those are my favorites. I hope that you also will do uh, the Makeup Mayhem videos. You don't have to do every day. I'm going to try to do every day. Um, you don't have to do every day. You also don't have to do all of the videos that I have listed in mind that I'm going to do, but you can try. I don't know. <laughs> um, thanks so much for watching. I hope you have a great month. Stay safe and look gorgeous. Bye.